Welcome to our tech troubleshooting video. Today we're tackling a frustrating issue that many iOS developers encounter. Our viewer is experiencing problems with automatic height calculations for UI table view section headers that contain UI labels. Let's dive into the details of this challenge. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your question, answering it, and hopefully finding that solution you need. Guys, remember to say just a little bit crazy, just like me, and work through to that resolution. Now, let's get started. Let's address the issue with the automatic height of UI table view section headers. First, ensure that your table view is set up correctly for dynamic heights. In your view did load method, you should have the following code to enable automatic height calculation for section headers. Next, implement the height for header and section method. This method should also return UI table view automatic dimension to ensure the height is calculated dynamically. If you're still facing issues, try calling set needs layout and layout if needed at appropriate times, such as after updating the content of your labels. Finally, check your UI stack view configuration. Ensure that the distribution and alignment settings are correct to avoid extra spacing or truncation. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. If you're having trouble with UI table view section headers not updating their height properly, here's a solution. Set the preferred max layout width for your multi-line labels to match their frame width. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix the issue with UI table view section header heights not updating properly, simply implement the estimated height for header and section function and return an estimated height. You can download the modified project with this fix from the provided link. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. When using UI table view automatic dimension, the height for section headers is calculated only once unless you manually call table view .reload data. This means if you change the header text, the height won't update automatically. To ensure the header height updates correctly, modify your setup function to change the header text dynamically based on the section index. Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. To fix the issue with UI table view section header heights not updating properly, you can store the header views in an array. Then, return the height of each view using the estimated height method.
Let's now look at another user-suggested answer. If you're facing issues with UI TableView section header heights not updating, remember that UI TableView Automatic Dimension works only when you provide a section title using Title for Header in Section or Title for Footer in Section. And that's it. I hope you found the solution that you're looking for. If you did, please hit subscribe. I'd really appreciate it. And until the next time that you need technical help, I hope you have a good one. Cheers.